Hi, my name is Steve Faulkner. This is Real Magic Review, and today I'm going to be reviewing Connected by Vinny Sagu. Before we carry on, could you please check out cardmagiccourse.com? That's my online card magic course. It's very, very good. Lots of testimonials that aren't actually on the sales page at the moment because I'm changing it all up. Um, but have a look at it and I'm sure you will like it. $9.99 a month and I'm adding to it every month. Uh, also, could you please like, subscribe, hit the little bell icon so you get notifications of when I go live. Uh, that'll be good. And also when I cancel, I had to cancel my live, well, postpone it um, from Monday to today. So it's usually uh, Mondays at four o'clock UK time. So Connected, when I read about it, to be honest, I was like, oh, really, I don't know about this, but I thought I'll, I'll give it a go. So you get it like this and it's just one card. One, I'll put it there and now I'll pick it up. Uh, one card. So it's a credit card size card. So it just goes in your wallet. That's obviously the, a good selling point. Um, and it's sold as a powerful, but I think it says something like one of the most powerful mind reading effects you're going to do. Let's have a look. Uh, handsome or small, the cleanest and easiest mind reading effects ever created. Right. Let's look at that. Is it easy? It's, quite, it's easy, but, it's, but to make it work well, you've, you've got to have done it a few times, I think. You've got to have practiced it. Well, that's fine. You know, no problem with that. Is it clean? Okay. Clean as in it's not, you're not going to get your hands dirty doing it. There's nothing else. There is discard, and that's quite a cool thing. All right. It's a, it's a bit different. It's a bit quirky. Um, clean. Right. Okay. Here's the effect. Have a look at one of those. Just look at one. Don't, obviously, don't tell me what it is. Just yeah. look at any picture on there. All right? And turn the card around, and you'll see these. I'm going to try and get into your head somehow. Is the first, think of the first letter of that, of the word that you're thinking that is a symbol. Right. Is that in the first dial there? Right. Is it in the second one? Okay. Is it in the third one? Is it in the fourth one? You looked at any one of these. Yeah, you haven't told me what it is. Is it a jellyfish? Yeah, no, but... okay. I don't think it's a very good trick. That's it. it. It might be clean. It might you might be able to carry it around in that, but when you've got these pictures and then this process, it's almost a problem that it's one object for me. If there was more stuff going on, you could kind of hide things that were going on with different language but you've got this and then that and do you know what it felt like and I'm really not being horrible it felt like sort of a, a version of something you a, a slightly more advanced version of something you get in a Christmas cracker I know it but it did I can't I've got to be honest with you it's got this kind of puzzle aspect to it now, that doesn't mean that if you were the sort of person that wanted to carry around this in your wallet and do it, but if you're a professional magician or if you're a serious magician, for me, there's, there's just, it, it's not going to work. There's too much. When I did it today, I said afterwards, be really honest, what do you think about that? And she went, well, I kind of didn't know how you do it, but I kind of did. And that sums it up, really. I was talking to someone yesterday about the centre tear. And I have a thing with the centre tear that it shouldn't make sense. In, in the way this shouldn't make sense, that you kind of, you tear it up. Why would you tear it up? But my thing with the centre tear is that it, you can't, it kind of makes sense a bit. If you really pick it apart, it doesn't. But you, I carry, and you can say a little thing like, oh, we'll just get rid of it, tear it up. It, it kind of is in the mo moment and the movement of the trick. This really jarred. The minute I said, right, look at that, you could see, they were like, what's that? And I didn't... I didn't want to perform this because I'd kind of made my mind up about it. And I had this, I had this thought of that, of thinking of Dr. Daly's last trick. And I had a thought of doing this and then walking out and getting run over and then saying, oh, that magician was here yesterday. His terrible story. He died, didn't he? What? Yeah, he did this thing. The last, he, he did this trick and I think it was something to do with dial. And I thought, God, that, what if that's my last thing? And that sounds awful. I'm not saying it because I'm saying it is such an awful trick, but it does prove a point that it was nonsensical enough for me not to want to do it, but I felt like I had to. And then I had to do a, another trick afterwards to kind of make up for it. I feel awful saying that. I don't like, like to do this, but I've got to be honest. I don't think, you know, you, the, the, I, can't, I haven't found any performance footage of this. Now, now apparently it's, it's okay for parlour and stage and things like that, but 
I can't find any performance footage and I couldn't find it on the demo and the demo just tells you how to do it and even if you look on the the trailer there's no performance footage and I think there's a reason for that because I don't really think many people are going to perform it it's a, it's kind of something you you, you would f find I don't know, some granddad, he's always got his pictures out again. He's doing a trick. It's, it's one of those sort of things. I don't, don't think it's up to standard of, of the stuff that's out at the moment. Uh, a quirky little aside, fair enough, um, but really not for me. But I'd love to hear if you've had better, better responses. Uh, so there we go. There's Connected. Um, just one man's opinion, okay? I, I, others are very, very... Um, Silly, right? <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Uh, others are available, so uh, so hit me up down in the comments. Let me know what you think. Cheers, bye.